Let's balance the net ionic equation for BeI2 plus Cu2SO4. This is beryllium iodide. This is copper 1 sulfate. That's because the sulfate's 2 minus. Each one of the coppers has to be 1 plus, 2 times 1 plus to balance the charge. So copper 1 sulfate. The first step with net ionic equations, we balance the molecular equation. It looks like we just put a 2 in front of the CUI, the copper 1 iodide. We have two coppers now. We have two iodines, beryllium, beryllium, and then a sulfate here and here. That's the balanced molecular equation. Now we can write the states, and that'll look like this. So most compounds with the iodide ion, they're soluble and sulfate. Compounds with the sulfate ion, in general, are soluble. One exception to the iodide, copper 1 iodide here is insoluble. It will not dissolve in water. Because of that, it's a solid falls to the bottom of the test tube as a precipitate in this reaction. So CUI is our precipitate. Now that we have the states, we can split the strong electrolytes into ions, and that's going to give us the complete ionic equation. That looks like this. So at this point, we can cross out the spectator ions. They're on both sides. And note, with net ionic equations, we don't split solids apart. So this CUI right here, these two CUIs, we didn't split those apart, so we're just going to leave those as is in our net ionic equation. So I can see that in the reactants on top, I have this beryllium ion and in the product. So that's a spectator ion. I'm going to cross that out. Looks like there's a sulfate in the reactants here and again in the products. So that's a spectator ion. We cross that out. What's left, that's the net ionic equation for BeI2 plus Cu2SO4. Clean this up and write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for beryllium iodide plus copper 1 sulfate. You note that we have a 2 in front of everything. We could reduce that down to 1, and we don't write the 1 by convention. So the atoms are balanced, and if you look at the charge, we have a positive and a negative. That balances out. That's a net charge of 0. Over here, net charge of 0. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for BeI2 plus Cu2SO4. Beryllium iodide plus copper 1 sulfate. Thanks for watching.